Hello. In this video, we are going to discuss one more table manipulation function in Power BI called as select columns. First, let's review the syntax and then try to implement it with the help of an example. Here is the definition and the syntax. Add calculated column to the given table or table expression. So here we have the syntax. It takes three parameter, table, expression, I name given to that expression in enclosed quotes. Okay, and we get a return value, a table. And if you notice here, it says adds calculated column. So it's very similar to add columns function, but a slightly different. With the help of an example, I'll try to show you how it differs from uh, the add columns function. So we have an example as well. So I have, a, let's say we have a table here country, state, count, and total. So let's try to use uh, this function, select columns, and then see what we get as a result. So let's go to the PBI. So I have the data loaded into, into this PBI. I have a table here, country, state, count, and total. So now let's start to explore add columns function first. So I'll call this as add columns table equal to add columns. And then we have to give the table name and then name. I want to do a concatenation of country and state. So I'm gonna give the name as country state in quotes and then expression is the concatenation of country and then ampersand I need a comma and the space ampersand and then a state and then hit enter so I'm going to get a new table here so if you notice here I have all the columns what is inside the info table plus the new column which I just created here. So it takes all the data from all the columns from the existing table plus it adds a new table. This is how add column function works. But let's, let's try to do the same thing with select column function. Select column. I'll call this a select column table and use the function select columns. Again, it asks for a table here. So in this case, it's an info, the name. This is the name of the expression, which I'm gonna calculate here. So again, I'm gonna call this as country state and expression, I want to concatenate country ampersand with, before I add state, I want to include a quotes, a comma within quotes, ampersand, and then state. So hit enter. Now notice the difference. So I'm getting only one single column has an output, right? Unlike the add column function here, I'm getting all the existing columns plus the new column. But here select columns, I'm getting only the column which I just created here. So this is the main difference between add column function and select column function in PBI. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.